And may the fourth be with you guys. So they finally finished painting and I was able to put my TV antenna back up, which means I have television again. Yay for having television again. Now I'm walking over to Rocky Studio, and then a bunch of us from over there, we're gonna go see Iron Man 3. I'm super excited about seeing Iron Man 3. Um, have you guys seen Iron Man 3? Let me know, did you like it? Alrighty guys, we just got out of seeing Iron Man 3. Did you like it, honey? I did, it was good. Everyone in the back, did you guys like it? Yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah? Okay, it was really good. And you guys think it was better than Iron Man 2, huh? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, I'm gonna have to agree with that. Do you think it was better than Iron Man 2, honey? I liked Iron Man 2, actually. No, I liked Iron Man 2. I just think this one had a bit, slightly better story. It was more about Tony Stark. This it was, this one was more, um, a little bit more humanizing, I think, mm -hmm. the, the story, which I like. More action packed like, than the second one, too. Yeah, it was a bit more action packed than the second one, too. So anyway, guys, definitely get out and see it in the theaters, because it was really good. It's worth seeing in the theaters. And yeah, so supposedly, what it's, he's renegotiating his contract, so Avengers is supposed to be his last Iron Man appearance. Watch Buzz throw down. Watch Buzz throw down and find out. <laughs> Alrighty, so we went with all the Pride Animation people, all the interns and whatnot, so, you know, give him a little break, a little bit of fun. And now I'm walking back home because I bought new headlights for Rocky's car, just the bulbs, um, new bulbs, because one of them burnt out, but you should always replace both of them at the same time. And the parking lot is nice and shady, so I figure I'm going to go ahead and do it there instead of in front of our house, which has way too much traffic on the street, and that's no fun doing car work there. So everybody cross your fingers and hope that it is easy to do because, I mean, it's very easily accessible. The, the question is, is it easy to do? <laughs> that is the question. Okay, guys, I'm going to pimp this product out a little bit. If you have never bought new bulbs for your car and never looked into it, these Sylvania Silver Stars are awesome because they are nice and bright. So unless you were lucky enough to have HID headlights in your car, um, these Silver Stars are way better than the stock halogen bulbs that came with So I highly recommend getting them if you ever replace bulbs in your headlights. Okay guys, so these headlights actually came out pretty easy. It's just got like a little thing here. The light bulb plugs into here and then you just and screw it in. Actually, don't even screw it in. It just twists. It just pops in. So. Rocky and I have to be awake at like 5 o'clock in the morning tomorrow, so <laughs> I'm ending this video early for a Saturday, and I will talk to you guys later. Expect to see some cool footage um, on next day's video for the ranch run, because it'll be very cool. Love and bubbles.